Welcome to healthyourmath.com. Today I'm going to do the find the mean and standard deviation from the frequency table. This is a frequency table. First, we need to find the midpoint. We let the midpoint x. Midpoint is between lower bound and upper bound from class. So it's 1 plus 2 9 over 2 equal to 5. 5 is the first midpoint on the first class. The same idea for the each class. And then we multiply the midpoint and frequency. So 7 times 5. And then the next column is x square times f of oh, phi square. So after we fill out the table, and then we find a total of each column. After we fill, find a total of each column, we apply those formulas to figure out what's the mean variance standard deviation. So in this formula, so it's the n here. So what's the n? The n basically equal to summation of f. So what summation of f means total of the frequency is 20. And then we plug in. So summation of f x times f is this column equal three o seven divided by the n. Since the n equal summation of f equal twenty, and then we find the mean. Fifteen. So in order to find standard division, we first find the valent first. This is a valent formula. And then we substitution. And in this case, 20 
multiply summation of x square f. Summation x square f is 6059. And then minus summation of fx and then square. Summation of fx is 307 and then square. And then over n is 20 here. Multiply n minus 1. And then I do a calculation. What's the top gives you? 3 How about the norm? It is 3.80. And then we run two decimal places. We get 96.13. So after we compute the valence, now we sub the valence to the standard division formula equals to square root of 13. And then square root of 96.13 is equal to 9.80.